Hey girls, welcome back to my YouTube channel. I don't know why I was trying to enter here. I just want to ugly people like say hello, what's up? Hope you guys are doing great. Thank you so much for joining back on your my YouTube channel. Today is a good day. I just I can feel it in my spirit that today is a good day. So if you guys see me, you know, bubbly and jumpy and all that, I don't know. I'm just grateful to be alive. I'm grateful to be able to record and talk to my people. If this is your first time of seeing my channel, please do not forget to subscribe. Do not forget to hit the bell button so you do not miss any upload. Okay. As you guys can tell from the title today, I will be trying for the first time or giving hair. This is my first time of trying this brand. This is my first time of trying their hair. This is my first time of seeing their hair. I know about them. I know they deal with a lot of um, natural texture hair. I am very excited and blessed to you know, be doing this review. This air was sent to me. However, I'm going to give you guys my honest review. The first thing I want to say is this packaging. I love how sturdy it is. It's not one of those flimsy, you know, um, cardboards that that you get your, you know, regular wig from or just a regular bag. This is actually useful. I see me storing this air inside this box because it is very. Yeah. The hair comes in a bag and. And then we also have a pamphlet. The hair I was sent is a given hair curly textured lace front wig. And this is the style C-O-L-F-W-01. I was sent 18 inches. I'm just going to show you guys quickly the construction of the wig. Oh, there is more stuff. In the bag, you get elastic band. Very useful. I have some regular wig combs. And also wig clips okay and there's also a card on here and this basically just um, describes the product it has my name on it the product type is lace front wig and it's 13 by 6 texture is curly curly 3c 4a texture air color is natural color and the cap size is extra small because I have peanut size head and this is the wig right out of the box i'm just gonna quickly show you guys the construction like i said earlier on it is 13 by 6. inside of the wig has three combs two in the front and one in the nape area it also comes with the elastic band and the elastic band is one of those ones that have like the bra the bra hook thingy so you can definitely adjust it i i, I know i'm gonna need to adjust it because like i said i have peanut size head Although this wig looks like it's going to fit me perfectly, but let's see. Let me just try it first. It fits really, really snug and I'm not using the elastic band. Like the elastic band is open and it fits really, really snug. And I think it feels, and I think it feels that way because I have my hair, my hair is not cur my hair is not braided back. My hair is actually just packed in a ponytail at the back. So the ponytail is giving me extra, extra edge size. You get what I mean? <laughs> you can tell the curls are really, really kinky. I cannot wait to brush this out. I can't wait to, to spray. I can't wait to spray this and, you know, finger, finger out the, the curls. I was told that the knot on this wig was already um, slightly bleached. So... I did not do anything to it. You guys saw me. I just took it right out of the box. And I was also told that it was also um, plucked already. And I think it looks pretty good. The wig also comes with the two adjustable straps at the back. So that's, you know, for extra support. I don't think I'm going to need that at all. It also comes with lace at the back. So I'm going to cut that off first. The first thing I'm going to do is take the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Setting Powder and this is the shade 40 Dark and I'm just going to tap a little bit of it onto the lace. To install my wig, I always use this two because that's the only thing that works for me. One, two is the only thing I know that when I take it off, my edges, the small edges I'm managing will not go with it. So I prefer to use this. I've tried using glue and I just feel like <laughs> I'm playing with fire. <laughs> I'm playing with fire when I use glue. 
I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna show you guys how I mix the two together. I just get a little container, squeeze some out like that much, and then I get the spray and I add the spray. Out of all the um, got to be glued gel whatever I feel like the spray has the strongest old so when I mix my concussion together I put a lot of the spray then I take a synthetic brush then I mix together after mixing this is after mixing the two together this is what it looks like it reminds me of glue it looks like glue but it's not glue it's gel and spray and all you need is water to take this out so i feel like i always feel i feel safe when i'm using it basically so now i'm just gonna start placing it on my airline lately i don't go straight in to using um my blow dryer i just kind of let it sit in for like five minutes on its own and then i go over it with my blow dryer now I'm gonna take my blow dryer and just blow dry it. Guys, now I'm going to quickly cut off the excess lace and I'm gonna do this in front of my mirror because I cannot use my viewfinder to cut up this lace. I'm just gonna mess up the wig so I'll be right back. So I've cut up the lace and now let's move on to some baby hair. You guys know I don't really like baby hairs but this one I want. But because this wig looks super natural already without even, like I'm not done styling the hair, but I can tell it's going to be a very natural looking wig. So I want a little bit of, I'm going to be taking a little bit of mousse. Just taking a little bit of mousse and I'm going to place it right here before I cut. First thing I'm noticing from this wig, guys, look at the parting space. This is amazing. Before I proceed with the styling, I'm going to take this band right here and I'm just going to tie it at the edge just so it can melt down everything really, really well. Right now, I'll be taking my spray bottle. In this bottle, I have majority water and a piece size of leave-in conditioner. So I'm just going to start by spraying. I'm just going to spray it just so it can loosen up the curls and then I'll comb it out. Y'all look at this side that I just sprayed and finger combed and look at this. This is about to be lit. Like it's, it's about to get lit up in here real quick, really, really quick. Do you guys see how I'm cheesing? This is so pretty. I also love the fact that you can see that the, it has um, some sort of layer effect to it. I really like how this wig was constructed. I'm going to quickly do my makeup and I'll be right back to show you guys the finished look. Alrighty those makeup completed. Hair looking fly. Let me show you guys. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Now I know why people do baby hair because look at this. Look at this naturalness. Like look at this, yo. <laughs> Whew, let me calm down. Let me calm down. But on a more serious note, I love, love, love. If I have to, if I have to say one thing about this, you know, this wig, it looks this definitely looks supernatural like this is hair goes right here this is what i wish my hair looks like i've been natural for like six seven years and did see no great grow <laughs> like i don't understand but this right here is goals this is what i wish my hair looks like um it looks like it's growing right out of my scalp like actually this side this side i tell you this side like yeah just focus on this side it is super duper beautiful. I love how lightweight it is, yet it is super full. If I'm to comb this out with a comb or with a powder brush, 
I know it will get bigger. I, I, I can see it getting bigger. Another thing that is good about this is that I can also spray it. I can also spray this down with water and some conditioner and I know it's going to give me like the fine curls. But I am loving this fierce, voluminous look. This is, this is my first wig ever. Even the ones I make myself, don't, they don't fit the way this is fitting on my head. Like it fits, like it's very, very snug. Like it's my exact size like the exact size of my head and it's, it's getting me very very excited and everything that's why I'm getting hot her giving hair they nailed the construction of the wig they nailed the texture I love the texture I love I just love everything about this wig I have nothing absolutely nothing bad to say about it the next time you guys see this hair I have plans for this hair like I, I, I like I already have ideas on what I want to do to this wig but this is about to be my winter hair. Like this, this is about to be it. This is it. All right, let me stop playing with this wig. <laughs> let me stop playing with the hair. Please be sure to check out my description box. I'm going to have all details of this wig in my description box, direct link to it and everything. So be sure to check my description box for all of the details on the hair. Okay. I do hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you for watching as always does. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye.